I forgot what to say. Hey guys, this is more of a serious video, but this is other updates about me, so let's just get started. This is only gonna be one update, but it's gonna be a huge update to you guys. I am having surgery. Not a big surgery, just to, well, it's a big surgery to me because it's my first surgery in the whole, my whole life. Um, uh, I am going to get my tonsils out. And a thing that makes, and another thing that makes me snore that I don't snore, but I will be able to still snore a little, but not automatic. I don't know what it's called, by the way. But from that, I will be gone probably wondering why I need my tonsils out um well my um throat has been hurting for uh, um a year and a half and um we went to two doctors in a year and a half the first doctor didn't help at all the second doctor I guess it helped all she did was do some blood tests All she did was blood test and uh, see if I had anything, but I did have mono, but it went away. So I was fine, basically. But yeah, I basically wasn't because it was still hurting at the period of time. So um, we went to the doctor specialist in um, throat, nose, and ears. He the they specialized in that. So my mom took me there because throat. So um. He said if it has been hurting for this long a time, it's probably her tonsils. So they said we will have to give her surgery. I'm like, and I was like, I was like, no, please don't. I thought I was scared. I was really scared. I was scared. Um, but he, he said the circumstances of getting my tonsils out is I will be in pain a little bit after the procedure is done. And I will be have to stay that there in that bed that they have for four to three hours, which kind of sucks. <laughs> and um, sit there and just probably talk to my mom when the surgery is done, cause yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. And the circumstances is, is I won't. Well, I won't be able to go to. I have to heal, so it would takes about a week to heal. So, I'm going to be laying on my bed or couch for a week. I cannot do anything. Nothing. It sucks. It really sucks. The procedure is going to be done in three weeks or six. It depends on my dad's job right now. So, yeah. Let's hope it's three weeks because I want to get this thing out of my neck. Or throat to be exact. But yeah, um, it's quite scary once you think about it, cause you're like, okay, so basically there's a difference between um, laughing gas and, so I forgot what it's called, knockout. Laughing gas just makes you feel loopy. It doesn't like make you go to bed. But this type that they're gonna put me on makes me go to bed. In 10 seconds or seven, it will put you out. It, it, that's what they're gonna put on me and I'm so scared and they actually had to put a needle through my skin basically where they could put a needle in me into the vein there and then it's gonna take about 10 seconds and then boom I'm out and then I won't even know what happened when I wake up and be like uh, I'm seriously gonna wake up and say what happened and then my mom's gonna be this is what my mom actually said and she says you're not even gonna remember what happened to you and she said, and she just, she said, you're just going to remember waking up. And I'm like, oh God. And yeah. And then I will have to stay in bed rest for about, as I said, a week. But the cool thing about the th for t three to two days, I will be only eating popsicles and ice cream. Best thing in the whole entire world. Probably get tired of it. So yeah. Sad sideways. That's it. Um. Hope you guys are fine with this. Um, it's in three to four weeks, so once I get the information, I will tell you guys in a short, tiny video. And yeah, so in those three to six weeks, if that happens, I will be making tons and tons of videos. I don't know if I'll make Demon Hunter because I'll be under stress and trying to 
to stuff and stuff. So, I won't be able to make a Demon Hunter. I don't know. I don't know, okay? Just don't. I don't know. So, yeah. That's it. Well, yeah, that's my news. Um, gotta go. Um, bye.